Hello, Shadowcat back with more Space Crew. And today we start off with an apology. Yes, I have to make an apology. To you, Solarian. No, not because I almost got you killed. I mean, you knew what you were signing up for. Nobody gets on this ship with it and has a guarantee of coming home every day. Okay? Definitely not for that. No, I spelled your name wrong. I thought it was I-A-N... But it's actually I O N, and now it's fixed. So you you are you are now Solarian spelled the correct way. It's the only thing I'm ever apologizing for. So you know, treasure this moment. Nope, actually we have other stuff that we need to do that's more important than apologies. We have exactly one task today, and that is to harvest antimatter. I don't know how we're even going to do that. This is a warship, not not a harvest ship. Is a harvest ship even a thing? I don't know. So, uh, we've developed an antimatter bomb that can destroy the phasmid... Phasmid, uh... Whoa, oh, whoa, whoa. Okay, hold on, hold on. we developed an antimatter bomb that can destroy the phasmid homeworld in one fell swoop. The rub is that it requires antimatter harvested from a pulsar in the gamma quadrant. Get in and get out before the radiation overcomes your crew. Okay. Um, this could be bad. We, we actually have to think about this for a minute. So we have to go and get a radiation sample. And our pathway is treacherous. So if we take the safe route, there's still one area with increased enemy activity... And if we take the short route, there's two places with enemy activity. Hmm. Well, I think that we're going to end up taking the safe route there, but once we pick it up, we may have to take the, uh, the short route home and make liberal use of our faster uh, jump engine. Yeah. Fortunately, however, we are all wearing radiation suits, so... Things are going to be fine there. Alright, Unicorn, I need you on that gun. You, I need up there. Cookie Jar, I guess, uh, just go. So we're carrying a thing. I don't know exactly what the thing is going to do, but we're carrying it. Terrible weapon capable of destroying... Yeah, we are going to go totally Ender's Game on this. Yeah. We... We we are gonna we're gonna go to their home world and we're gonna blow up their home world. I mean it may be somewhat cliche to point out the tropes involved in this, but I mean when you're doing it, it's kinda hard to ignore it. Alright, let's go. Okay, so now here's where things get hairy. I didn't realize that we were going to be under the radiation hazard as soon as we got here, but here we are. Alright, jettison the probe. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, that's it. Now we get out of here. Wait, that's it? We don't have to, like, retrieve it or something? Okay. Okay. So, is it just going to, like, come back home on its own? Alright, well, we didn't have to bring home the, uh, the radiation-filled probe, but we got this instead. We need to get out of here. That is a radioactive comet. Wait, there's a wormhole drive? Where? I don't see it. That could be our key out of here quickly. There it is. All right, cookie jar, set a course. Before we all get swarmed with radiation. Wintro, you are not ready to auto-hack this. However, the code is right there. 25 seconds before we get a lethal dose of radiation. So I need this one. This one, this one again, 
And this one. Try inputting that. That's it. Let's get out of here. All right, here we go. This place sucks. Wintro, I need you to take care of tagging. I need you to handle all the fighters while I get us through here. Cookie Jar, I'm going to need all of your piloting skills. Everyone else, just hold them off. What? Alright then, everyone remain in your stations. I have a solution. Security? Okay, wait, wait, wait. Vent the ship. Go. All right, everyone's out. All right, close the door, close the door, close the door. Unicorn, get to work on oxygen. Come on, we need to get out of here. I know people are, are injured. Get to work on the shields. Reactor is in bad condition. I need you to go help on the reactor. Uh, we're here. I think. Wait, this isn't home. We didn't quite make it home. All right, cookie jar. I need you to, to take us in. Security? Well, hold on. First, we have enemies coming in. We're going to have to handle this very carefully. Security? Stealth. You handle that engine. You handle that engine. And Wintro? Call in support. Give those aliens something to play with. All right. Stow your suit. You also stow your suit. How much time do we have left in that stealth mode? Ten seconds. Okay. Unicorn, I want you to extinguish fires. You get back on your gun. Everyone get ready. Things are about to get really hairy really fast. Stealth mode is broken. You up on the forward gun. Cookie jar. Put us into an attack vector. Now that the ship is back online, it's time we join the fight. Unicorn, where are you at? I need you on a gun. Put that away. On your arms. I cannot believe it didn't take us all the way home, but you know what? It took us most of the way. As a matter of fact, we could probably rush this jump. All right, so gunners, I want you to target the uh, the, the 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 starburst thing. Solarian, you are in trouble. Okay, Solarian, I'm gonna pull you off the gun. All right, fast jump charge. We need 20 seconds. Come on. Hold them off. Three, two, one. Go. Whew, just like that. Okay. All right, so we collected antimatter. We went through a wormhole and we made it home. Of course, we left the probe there, so, like, how are we going to get the antimatter? I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't make any sense. But it doesn't have to make sense. Point is, we did it. We did what the eggheads wanted us to. 
So presuming they get the antimatter back, then are they going to have a bomb for us? We hacked a beacon. Yep, everything is good. We can't level up anymore. Skipping that. So now what do we have left? Yep, destroying the Phasmid homeworld. You know, this is actually following the entire trajectory of Ender's game. And I'm actually kind of feeling bad for them now. Because I know how Ender's game ended and what happened. I don't want to be that guy. I don't. I don't want to be that guy. But we're going to be that guy anyway. So, looks like there's two paths to take. But I see no reason not to take the short... Or no, you know what? One, two... There's only two jumps and only one sector with increased activity. You know what? We may well, we may well take the uh, the short path. And I can't believe they're still giving us credits in research. It's like, what are we supposed to do with it? Oh, is that it? That's it, right there. That's the bomb. Okay. Uh, yeah. Let's, uh, let's be careful with that. Place the antimatter bomb in the cargo bay, make your way to the phasmid, and destroy it. Humanity's counting on us. Well, you know, nothing like high expectations. So there's the safest route. Fastest route. Only two jumps to get there and two jumps back? I'll take it. So, do I need to be worried about this thing? I mean, I don't think I do, but I'm still a little bit worried. Oh, great. And the first place that we jump into is an ion storm. Yes, I'm sure you have. Okay, unicorn. I'm going to need you on the reactor. Because when the ion storm pops, it's going to shut everything down. Oh, oh, and we got this. Okay, well, I guess we're doing this now. So first off, attack vector. Unicorn, get the reactor back online. And then, go ahead and get on a turret. Why would they be dumb enough to attack us here? I mean, the last time we fought in an ion storm, it was, um, bad. But we'd also been through a neutrino storm just before that. This time, however? I mean... What do you hope to gain from this? Alright, the add-on storm should be coming soon. Yep, there it is. Alright, in five seconds I pull Unicorn off. Unicorn? There it is. Ready, and... Okay, get to work. Alright, good job. And we have new contacts to target. Are those boarding pods? They better not be boarding pods. I will not hesitate to flush them out the back, just like I did before. Or I wonder, do they know what we have on board? Do they know what we're doing? Oh wait, that is a boarding pod. Cookie jar? Evasive piloting, please. <laughs> Alright, where was it? I don't remember where it was. Wait, was that one it? That looks kind of like it. blow that thing up before it can get close. Come on. Oh, wait. It happened again. 
Unicorn, get the reactor back up. I was too focused on the, the boarding pod and I wasn't paying attention. That's a critical mistake. It's fine though. It's fine. It's fine. Ooh, good shooting. Nice shot, Solarian. Blew that boarding pod right out of the sky. Alright, I don't know how we got off of an attack vector, but get us back on an attack vector. Starburst is destroyed. Ion Storm Burst is incoming. Again, we're going to wait for the five second mark and then we'll pull Unicorn. And now. Here it comes. Alright, get to work. Good job. And you guys destroyed the last one? Okay. Fastest route. Let's get out of here before we can get hit again. Everyone's health looks pretty good. My security officer is a little bit hurt, but he'll be fine. All right, let's go. All right. There it is. I have to expect that they're going to throw everything they have at us. So here's what's going to happen. Security? No, not security. Solarian. I want you to be the one to drop the bomb. The reason being, I'm expecting them to be in front of us. And... We, we have to just keep going. Everyone else, though, throw everything you have. Oh, they are behind us. Cookie jar? Evade. There we go. No break a thing beam on my ship. Wintro, bring in all the support we have. Analyze our performance. Now, I, Solarian, I know you are our most important gunner, but I, we, we gotta do what we gotta do. Oh, there's a fire. Solarian, you can actually handle this while they're fighting. You know how to use a fire extinguisher, right? Remember, pull the pin, aim the nozzle, sweep the fire, and I forget what the last one is. Okay. 600 meters. Ready? Our engines are coming down. Alright, here's what we're going to do. Stealth. Stealth us. Alright, we're approaching the release point. Solarian, ready? Ready? Go! Okay, we're waiting for the bomb to arm now. Solarian, get back to your turret. And security. As soon as stealth mode drops. Three, two, one. Go. Cookie jar. Attack vector. No, wait. Defensive positions. Everyone else? Well, Solarian, you're the one with the abilities left. Wintro, start auto-tagging people. Cookie Jar, evasive piloting. And inspire the crew. Recharge some of those abilities. Unicorn, I need reactor work. Bomb arms, now! There it goes. 
Boom! <laughs> oh, it is gone! Yeah, we are genocidal monsters! Wait, what? Okay, now they're completely ripping off Bender's game. Wait, she's going to Earth. Um, okay. We need to go. Go, 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 go. Uh, Unicorn, go fight some fires. You. We need engine work. Okay, well, honestly, uh, didn't see that coming. We gotta get back to Earth. We gotta hurry. Okay, engine repaired. Get in here. You get on that turret. Okay, that's all good. All right, Cookie Jar, come on, hurry up. Bring us, bring us to the gate. I don't even care what you have to skip on the way home. Just get us home. Right? Go. Ooh, actually, that might be exactly what I need. An unstable wormhole drive. There's enemies incoming, but if we can hack that, we won't even need to deal with them. But I have a feeling they're going to get here before we get to it. Auto tag is back up. We're going to need that once we get in there. Because I will need to help direct things as much as I can. Looks like another one of those... Uh, Beacons that we just bumped out of the way. Okay, auto-hack that. Incoming fighters. Oh, never mind. We don't need to worry about it. What? Um. Okay. That did not take us very far at all. But you know what? Whatever. I'll take it. Let's just go. At least it got us away from those fighters. Question is, did it throw us into even more? Wait, something's breaking. The gravity generator. Well, we have gravity boots on now, so I'm not too worried about that. And gravity generator's fixed. All right, so you get back on there. Cookie jar, take us through the gateway.
Okay, back to Athena Station, which is good because things are on fire. Not too worried about it, though. Unicorn, take care of the fires. And Cookie Jar, bring us in. So, Phasmid Homeworld, absolutely gone. Like, completely, absolutely gone. Unequivocally gone. <laughs> Unfortunately, now, Earth itself is under attack. Again. Let's see what we're up against. Alright. Homeworld destroyed. That's good. Of course, no one leveled up. Although we deserve it. The Phasmid Queen has traveled by wormhole to Earth's solar system. Athena Station will follow to destroy the Phasmid Queen and defend Earth. Targeting Earth. Charging the wormhole drive. I hate this part. Okay, well, I think I left my appendix back in the Delta Quadrant, but, you know, I need to get rid of that thing anyway. Alright, so here we are. I'm assuming we have exactly one mission left. It's time to save the Earth. We prevent the Phasma Queen from reaching Earth and launching her spores to the planet's surface. Well, let's do it. We can't stop now. We've come this far. We're not stopping now. Cookie Jar, get us out there. Can't believe the Asteroid Dodger is going to be the savior of Earth. Not the Enterprise. Not the Millennium Falcon. Alright, so I guess we're jumping past the sun to get to Jupiter? Weird, but okay, let's do it. Go. Whoa! Okay, didn't see that coming. We need everything! Okay, and Wintro, go ahead and auto-tag things, because we're going to need it. That is a big ship with a lot of weapons. Upper shields have failed. Forward shields have failed. Why can't you use dorsal and ventral like any other ship-based person captain thing. They're dorsal and ventral. Okay, we need to move from here. I think we got the bottom covered. We need to go up top. Move us, cookie jar! Yeah, it looks like one, two, three, four, five, six on the bottom. Done. There's untagged fighters out here. I guess I'm going to have to help out. Watch those engines. Things are getting hot. Alright. Evasive piloting. We'll, we'll drunkenly fly over the top of this thing. And we'll, we'll pepper the top of it with, with missiles and lasers and everything else. Honestly, tagging all of these seems kind of pointless, given that if we just defeat the uh, mothership... Oh my! Everything's on fire over there! 
Extinguish fires and then get back to your station. Where do we stand? We need to get in there and blow up that last one. I think it's that one right there. All right, good. Now we need to get underneath this thing to get to the reactor. Shields are doing a major fade. It's launching more fighters. Of course it is. Can you replenish our shields? Yeah, replenish shields. You stow that fire extinguisher. Get back on your gun. Shields are back up. Get back on the forward weapons. All right, target that reactor. Come on. We need to get there. We're taking so much fire. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Missile attack. All right, evasive piloting. Come on, it is almost done. There it goes. Oh boy. That was close. All right, shields are broken, but Unicorn, you're too hurt. Uh, I need you to go work on the shields. Unicorn, you need to rest up. Cookie Jar, we have an objective. Take us to the Epsilon segment of the Asteroid Belt. All right, you're good. Back on turret. That was tough for a mothership. All right, Unicorn, you're pretty good. I need you to repair the reactor before we jump. Quick and easy fix. Good. Cookie Jar, are we ready yet? We are now. Let's go. A Phasmid Beacon? Where? Where? There. Okay. A minute 40 left. It's fine, though. We'll get there. We'll hack it. We need to hack that before they can call in any support. Wait, what are those in the distance? It's that. Oh, there's the queen right there. Oh, she is big. She is very big. You know what? You can go get some time in the healing thing while we hack this. Auto hack it. Come on, Wintro, you can do this. Good job. Cookie jar, next gate. Uh, she is just launching stuff into our solar system. Stop that! I don't think she's going to listen to me. No, she's not. All right, let's go tell her personally then. There she is. A freighter will be arriving. Defend it while it sets up a jump gate. Wait, really? We can't just attack? All right, we can do this. We can do this. Here comes a flying saucer with one of those break a thing beams. Let's focus on that. And we'll keep them focused on us, not the freighter. Oh, uh, it's another flying saucer. Come on, don't let that thing kill us. Don't let it break the gravity. 
Okay, good. You didn't let it break the gravity. All right, you guys want to play with me? Come on, let's go. We're going this way. Leave the freighter alone. And come play with me. They're not doing a very good job of playing with me. All right, target that flying saucer. Blow it out of the sky. All right, flying saucer's gone. More coming in from the rear. Solarian, get on them. Lots of fighters coming in. But all total, there's only like a half a dozen of them. We can handle this. Relying a lot on you. And by you, I mean Solarian. Since most of them are behind us. Take them out. Evasive piloting is back up. That's good. Because we're going to need it soon. Okay, we can navigate to the Phasmid Queen. Somehow. Looks like the freighter is gone. And our engine is damaged. It's okay. Defensive and... Oh, both engines are damaged. Lovely. Take out that fighter. All right, the Unicorn and my other side gunner. This is on you. Wait, what? An explosion from our ship reactor. A one-way ticket for those who stay on board. Use the jump gate inside the Queen then activate the self-destruct. I don't really feel like dying. But you know what? We have something for that. We'll get in there, we'll activate the self-destruct, and then I'll tell everyone to abandon ship. And perhaps, perhaps we'll all get out in time. They're the best ones that I can, uh, that I can afford, so, you know, I hope so. I have, however, been using them to hold snacks. Solarian, I need you to clear all the snacks out of the escape pods. We're going to need them. And you don't have a whole lot of time. Don't bother putting them away. Just dump them on the floor. All right, here we go. All right, we're inside the Phasmid Queen. Cookie Jar? No, not Cookie Jar. Unicorn. Is it here? Yep. Self-destruct. I hope the escape pods can even get out of here. Or do we not even get that option? We didn't even get the option. Well, that was just sad. I mean, granted, we saved all of humanity, but... No one got to come home. And we lost the asteroid dodger. Rest well, old ship. You've been through a lot. And everyone was killed in action. I should have ejected a whole bunch of escape pods before we got in there. I thought we'd have a chance, though.
<sighs> I guess this is everything that we managed to accomplish. All total, or told, I'm actually rather proud of everything we've done. We defeated every single one of their aces, we destroyed their homeworld, we killed the queen, we wiped out an entire race. I mean, how many people can lay claim to that? And now that it's all over, I'm satisfied. You know, I'm not happy that everyone died, but I'm satisfied. I think that we can rest now on our accomplishments and say that we we did good. From a certain point of view, at least. I mean, wiping out an entire race? Subjective, at best. So yeah, this was Space Crew. And right off the bat, I want to thank everyone who was a part of my Space Crew. Cookie Jar, Wintro, Unicorn, Solarian, I mean, the only people we didn't get was a security officer and a side gunner, but for those that did come with us, thank you. Sincerely. I just wish that I could have done better by you. And now, I guess we go on and do something else. Perhaps a second life for everyone. A new start. New environment, new places. Yeah, I never know how to end these things. I always hate endings. Either way, though, however you feel about it, I don't know how I feel about it. But this was Space Crew. If you enjoyed watching this and you want to try this on your own, I got this game on Steam. I highly recommend it. Fantastic game. And even if you don't, remember, you can always come back here, watch all these stories again. And even if you don't want to do that, there will be further stories in the future. So, that's what I'm going to get to, and that's what we get to look forward to. So, from the bottom of my heart, thank you for watching. If you've been enjoying this, make sure to subscribe so you're here for every story coming up in the future. Share this with anyone else you think would enjoy it, especially now that it's done. They can sit down and watch the entire journey beginning to end. Like, leave a comment down below, and I will see you for the next series. Till then, take care.